Good morning. Welcome to our second day of our mid-year conference for the Association of Black Psychologists. I am Dr. Tiffany Porter, the mid-year chair. I am excited for today. We have a lot of um, wonderful, wonderful events that are going to happen uh, between this morning, this afternoon. And then we're also going to have uh, for our members that are watching, we're gonna have another event later on. What we are gonna do now is welcome Ia Pat Canton. She is our elder of elders and she is going to do our libations this morning. Thank you, Ia. Am I on yet? Yes, good morning, good morning. Good to see you. Um, happy to see everyone here up early, early enough on a Sunday morning. My libations are going to be short because we have a lot of business to tend to. And, uh, you know, of course, starting with the program, the Mbongis, calling everyone together <clears throat> and ending with libations. So we will start this morning um, by pouring libations into this plant. And we begin with asking the ancestors and all that are all that are above us, uh, whether you call it Allah, whether you call it Jehovah, whether you call it Oludumari, uh, whatever your name is for the Holy Spirit and those above us, we pour and we say Ashe. 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 Yeah. For, for all who do good works on earth, for those who protect children, for those who protect those who cannot protect themselves, for those who are teachers, for those who are helping like us, those who are having problems living on the streets. We say, Ashe. 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 Before libations, for ourselves. We pour libations for our organization. We pour libations for our families. We pour libations so that we can give ourselves the energy, the strength that the spirits, that the ancestors intend for us. We pray that we sustain our energy in ABCI, that we keep our energy here, that we remember who we are, the purpose of having all of this is for us to remind ourselves from where we came. We came with strength. We cannot leave our strength here for others to abuse. We maintain it, we work it. And today, particularly, we dedicate ourselves to making that happen. We say, Ashe. Ashe. We give you a moment to call out the names of all of your ancestors that you can remember. And this is a worthy exercise. If you haven't done this before, you need to take the time to sit and write out the names. If you have your family, your parents available to you, talk to them, find out who left, because those are the names that you're gonna call on when you need sustenance. So call out the names of your, your heroes, your sheroes, your cultural heroes, your cultural sheroes, call out the names now. James Brown, Bernice Brown, Obama, Madeline Chigley, Everett London, Mother Rose, London Senior, Harry Woods, the Debtor Bell, Albert Debtor Bell, William Anthony Bradford, Uncle Arthur, May Nelson, Golden, Papa Golden. C. Uh, Diane Howe, Tamil uh, Porter, uh, Asa okay. Hilliard, Dr. Right. Pukiao, Robert right. Williams. Right. Robert Williams, Harold Dent. Uh, Harold Dent. Right. We are here. We are here. We have work to do. We have work to do. Ashe. Ashe. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ia Pat. We are truly grateful for you. 
We are now going to introduce our uh, rituals uh, committee. And we have our co-chair, Brother Jermaine, who is going to do our honoring of the ancestors. Thank you so much, Brother Jermaine. Absolutely, Hotep family, greetings. Uh, Madam GA Chair, thank you for your service, your labor of love to all of the past presidents, to our immediate current president, our president elect, and to our elders. Um, it is with your grace, with your work, with your honor that we share uh, this tribute to the ancestors. Um, yeah, Pat. Uh, do I have your permission to continue? You do. Thank you, Baba. And so this was shared um, during Kwanzaa, and uh, it was asked that we reshare this. Uh, and as the Rituals Committee talk, uh, what you're about to see, we plan to expand. Many have already thrown names. Uh, the last time we showed this, names went in the chat that we didn't know about. Um, as we build our organization, um, as we move Black forward, it is crucial that our ancestors stay with us. And as the ABCI Ancestor Project through our historian, uh, Dr. Benson Cook, who is doing an awesome job of uh, recording this history, uh, the Rituals Committee works in tandem uh, with the historian to ensure that our deep, rich history is provided to all in this association, old and new and future. And so it is with deep, deep reverence and respect to our ABC ancestors, uh, past presidents, current presidents, elders, and members that we offer you this small tribute to our ancestors. Are you all seeing the screen? Yes. Yes. Perfect. See it. Standardized tests by their very composition and construction are biased against minorities. On anybody who is not white middle class, the items just don't fit. Mm -hmm. And I can give you examples that would go on forever. <laughs> but we've got to help people understand that. We cannot generate, we cannot engage in a lawsuit unless it's generated by a parent. And we've got to educate parents to do that.
take a moment family as i get off my knees i honor we honor our ancestors and when i when i play this it is is reverence right whether we stand whether we kneel what the rituals committee uh envisions is the entire association sharing with dr benson cook dr anthony smith myself any of our contributors to our association at the local and national chapters, this is our history. We intend to honor it. One day this will play for an hour because we will correctly record our history. And at uh, FAMU, we've institutionalized this project to build on it each year. This spring, students in our directed individual studies course have the AB Psy Ancestor Project. They get a grade for interviewing distinguished psychologists, learning those who transitioned, and we need you to help them with their grade. 
as beautiful as this presentation is, we got to build on it. It's a lot more that's needed. And the only way to close those gaps is you. <laughs> so whether it's a psychologist whose name wasn't there that done so much work that the rituals committee didn't know about, or Dr. Cook, which I doubt seriously, but Dr. Cook may not have known about it. Please share this information with us so we can get our history right and honor it in the way that we always should. This is the foundation of our association. This is its lifeblood, and we need you to make sure it continues. Madasi. Ashe, thank you very much, Brother Jermaine. That was absolutely beautiful. And we truly appreciate you for this beautiful tribute to our ancestors and appreciate the fact that you are continuing this legacy even with your students. So thank you so much. All right, and Bongi will start at 11 o'clock. So we have a few moments for a break and we will come back at about five till and we will reconvene for our Mbangi at 